Hello everybody, this is Riser or Logan, and today I'm going to show you how to tie the Eldridge knot. Okay, so as you can see, I just uh, took apart the knot here, and we're going to get started. For this knot, you should have a longer tie. I'm using a silk tie, and to start, I just have the longer end on my left shoulder, and the smaller end on my right, and I'm just going to bring, I'm just going to pull on that short end, and move that long side up until it hits my belly button and then I'm just going to reach near the top here and I'm just going to pinch pinch the top and I'm going to bring that to the center I'm going to grab my short end and I'm going to cross it over for this step I just going through I just like to switch hands here so it's a little bit easier to control I'm going to take the small end and I'm going to go up through my neck and since I started with the small end on my right side I'm gonna bring it down to the right side next I'm just gonna move this and go underneath and I'm gonna bring it across the face this step should be tight bring this across tight next I'm just gonna go up my neck hole here and I'm going to bring it back down to my right side because I started there. I'm going to go underneath again and you, you just made a hole right here so you're just going to use your fingers just to open that hole a bit and you're going to feed your smaller end through that hole. Just get that through and you're going to go bring it to the top and you're going to bring it down the neck hole this time. Okay, to uh, finish it off, you're going to take the small end, and you're going to go across the knot itself, you're going to cross the top here, and then you're going to bring it down through the neck hole. And just like the previous step, you went through that hole, you're doing the exact same thing. So I just have this final knot here, I'm just going to loosen that up just a, just a bit, I'm just going to run that small end through. I have my finger here just to help me guide. And I'm going to tighten that off. With this small uh, extra piece here, I'm just going to hide that with the rest of my tie. I'm just going to pop down the collar. Make sure everything's nice. To uh, move it up if you need it. Just grab the um, grab the tie here, and you're just gonna push it up. And then you just you want to make sure that's all center. And there you go. There's the Eldridge knot. When you finish with the knot, you'll see that uh, it's kind of short, coming down your chest, and your stomach. So, like I do, I I like to wear a pullover V-neck sweater, just because of the shortness just to try and cover that up the knot itself is what everybody wants to see so if you even if you have a striped tie with some colors in it try and pick one of those colors that match throw on that sweater everything will match nobody will see the extra part here all that short stuff you're good to go okay guys we'll see you next time